Hello everyone, my name is Prikhar Kumar and welcome to Code Tech Jar. So today I am going to solve another leap code problem. So the problem is done in sum of 1D array. So here the array nums is given. So we have to define the running sum of an array as running sum of i equal to sum of all the previous numbers. Okay. So here the input array is given as nums 1, 2, 3, 4 and the output here is as 1, 3, 6, 10. So how this output has come? The explanation is just that here 1 will be printed as 1. So first number will be printed as like that only and the other numbers will be added to the previous ones. So 2 will be added to 1, it will become 3. So and 3 will be added to 1 and 2. So it will become 1 plus 2 plus 3 equal to uh, 6. And 4 we add, will be added to the previous numbers. So 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1. So it will be like 10. Okay. So this is how it will be done. And similarly case for this. Here 1 will be, will be printed as 1. And then 1 will be, will be added to the previous number 1. It will be 2. And then 1 will be, will be added to the previous 2 numbers. Then it will be 3. And the 4th 1 will be added to the all previous 3 element. So it will be 4. And the fifth number will be added to the all four uh, ones. And so four plus one equal to five. Okay. So it's like that. Let's solve this problem. Another example is there. We can solve like that. We can clearly understood that. And from this example, only at the end, this explanation what they have provided, we can clearly understand what is the problem. So let us solve this problem. It is very simple, uh, and it uh, will take uh, uh, minimum number of steps to solve this problem. Okay. So here we have to just define the variable int sum equal to 0 because we are taking the sum of the array. Okay. So in sum equal to 0, then for int i equal to 0, then i less than i less than nums dot tenth. Okay. So because we have taken the array nums, so we have starting from 0 to the nums dot length, then i plus plus. Okay. Then we have to do sum equal to sum plus nums of i. So what has happened here? So sum will be 0 plus nums of i. So 0 plus the another number of the array. 0 plus first number, second number, third number, fourth number, fifth number, till the end of the array. Okay. Like that it will be there. And then nums of i equal to sum. Okay. And what we have done here, I will explain again. So here just declare the variable sum as 0. Then I have iterated the value of i from starting from 0 to the last index. And then and we have done i plus plus. And then we have done the sum equal to sum plus nums of i. So what will be done here? 0 plus the first element. Okay. And then, uh, then the second element will be the second element plus the first element plus the 0th element or third element. Third element plus second element for first element for zeroth element like that it will be done. Okay. And then we will return nums. Okay. So it will execute. So we are returning the nums array. Okay. Let's run this code. Yes, it, it has accepted the code. For example, one, two, three, first gear. So output is one, two will be added to one, three, three will be added to two and one, six, four will be added to three and two and one, ten. Okay, let's submit this code. Yeah, I think it would accept the code. Yes, it has accepted the code. The runtime is 1 millisecond and it's faster than 25.42% of Java online submission. That's really good. And uh, yeah, so you can see that all four, four test cases are submitted. So these are the easy uh, questions that we are solving. Sooner we are going to solve the harder ones, uh, but uh, uh, this uh, is solving easy questions will. Uh, make your your understanding good and uh, you can solve the higher uh, set of questions so thanks for watching please like and subscribe my channel and please share with all of your friends so that they are, so that they can also study lead code coding problems because it's very beneficial for your coding growth thank you